got it. There we go. Hello, welcome anyone, everyone who's watching. Um, uh, this is day four of our live stream edit of Like a Huge Scotland. It's a four screen artwork that's going to be in Fruit Market Gallery Edinburgh uh, next week. And so we decided just to expose our editing process, <laughs> which was a slightly dangerous thing to do, but why not? If you're just joining us today, the sort of question is, where have you been? <laughs> because I mean, all the most of the creative decisions, frankly, are completed now. We we've established the world of the story, the characters, the tone, the mood, the music, etc. So we're basically what we say in editing parlance is we have locked it. Uh, but what we're going to do today is is look uh, at the individual images. And th this could be one of the most boring bits. Um, but for me, I just love this bit because this is about framing and just adjusting a shot up, about, up a bit left, a bit down, a bit right, a bit, etc. And looking a little maybe even at color occasionally. I don't know. Will we Can we do color today, Timo? Yeah, yeah. Yeah. So that it's it. It used to be called onlining this process, but it's not, or for me, it's just that final micro adjustment of the image to make it sit right in the frame. So for the next probably couple of hours, we will be doing that. And um, whether you want to stay with us or keep us in the background while you're making your pasta sauce, whatever you want to do, uh, feel free to join us. Um, this is this is a project, as I've said, each day is project funded by Creative Scotland in collaboration with the great people at the Wilhelmina Barnes Graham Trust. And we're getting towards the end of the creative experience. Apologies um, if I'm even less articulate than usual and I'm looking at myself and I'm looking knackered. It's because I'm on day, I think, five of COVID and it's kicking in. It's sort of it's saying it's sort of saying me stop, just rest. But I'm thinking no, I want to work with Timo. So here we go. Here we go. Mm -hmm. So should we just? I mean, so like I did screen four, three, and two, and I'm six minutes into screen one. Right. So, right. so, so you've done a lot of work, of prep work here. So, hopefully, there isn't much to change. Yeah. So, should we just start at the where? Where would you like to start, Timo? At the beginning of screen one, or where do you want to go? So, like, I could either you could watch me adjusting the rest of this, um, and then tell me, oh, don't do that, don't do that, or we just go through stuff that I've already finished. Let's let's go through stuff. That, you know, because there are things there, I mean, I, for anybody who's been watching us, they know that lots of the images that are <coughs> on, on, on one of the screens recur on the other screens, isn't that right? So, um, so whatever yeah. change we make on one will might affect two, three, four, et cetera. So if, if it's okay, Timo, let's just go back to whichever screen you would prefer to, that you've completed, like any of them, right. and then we'll look at it and see. Okay, so, so um, this, is, this is screen four. Are we going to start with screen four? Yeah. Okay, great. So um, the, the for people who, I don't think we've said this too explicitly before, but this will be a four by three event. So each of the big screens in Fruit Market will be four by three. Isn't that right, Timo? Yeah. Yeah. And that means that four that way, and three that way. So for example, Timo, this image, have you cropped it to be four by three? Yes. So like, I mean, I was told, first I was told it was four by three and then I was given a pixel, um, like that the, the image should be 1080 by 1080. And I was like, well, that's not four that's by not three. Right. And right. then um, I was told it's 1440 by 1080. So what I've done is I made, I made an image which is uh, that one here. Yeah. To um to give you the so like that's 1440 yeah. by 1080. Yeah. And so then what I've done, so yeah. yeah, and then basically what I've done is if you have an, a full image here, yeah, 
Um, okay. Which is I'm what I shot. So I, I over, for people who, so I shot 16 by nine, which is wider than four by three. So Timo's having to crop the image to make it four by three. So, I mean, just, just for demonstration purposes. So that's the, that's what Marcus shot. Uh, no. <laughs> Oh, so you've shifted it a little bit as well, so that the car is more shifted it a bit over, yeah. Yeah. but like basically that's the that's the mass that goes on top of it. Yeah. So that's good. Um, Great. Well, that I mean that's and four by three is a lovely frame. I like that, you know. And so it's so that's very good. And um, so you've shifted this image a little bit. Which I just because uh, because we kind of yeah we're concentrating on the car, so yeah, put yeah. a bit more central basically. Mm -hmm. So uh, that's good. I think just take a little bit of the blue out. Timo, just warm it up slightly. <clears throat> yeah. And contrast wise, you know, this is where I find it difficult. So obviously I'm looking at this image through Zoom, Timo, but on your, I mean, the, the initial rushes, I remember the contrast was pretty good. Is, is it, are the blacks good and black in this? Yeah, I mean, we could okay. probably, it's like, it's a bit of a misty morning, it's not misty, but like it's kind, it's yeah. a bit of a but, morning picture. And I'm shooting into the light, as you can see here, so yeah. it always sort of flattens the image. So, oh yeah, actually that's quite nice just to punch that black a little bit. Yeah, I think that's nice. Thank you. Okay, and, so when we make a change, it makes sense for me to just make that an all... All four screens, yeah. All four screens. Yeah. Um. And you just have to drag that effect down, do you, onto the, each of the four? Well, screens. I just copy the shot because it's the same shot. Okay. I just copy the whole shot and overwrite what I have here. I promise I'll try to make as few changes as necessary. That's all right. That's, like you say, it's not the most exciting bit, and you love it, and I, I don't. Just, but I it's know. part of it, you know? It's just... It's, I, I, you love it because... You know, when you, I, I just think people who are really fascinated by sound, if a sound is slightly wrong, it's like nails on a blackboard, you know? And for me, if an image just is slightly the wrong color or the slightly the wrong shape, it's the same thing. So I do love this moment. Okay, so we go back to... So that's just like like a huge Scotland, you know? Yeah. And just to go back to the cow, so what I just saw is with the blue reduced, yes? Yeah. Okay. It's still looking quite blue, do you think? Do you not think? It is, yeah. Um, I guess I know the, it green, is. the green got a bit more green. I mean, it's a very blue image, if you think of it, like even the shadows are blue. And I'm just stuff. looking at the sky, you, you don't want the sky to go yellow, but could you just take the blue down a little bit more, sorry. Because <clears throat> as you say, this is morning, so the background trees would be quite golden. A little bit more, Timo, sorry. Yeah. Thank you. The green, the, the foreground grass is coming better. Thank you. Yeah, fine like that. Yeah, perfect. It's nice seeing these images full screen, isn't it? If any, if any of you have been dropping into the edits over the last four days, you'll have noticed that we were editing within four quadrants. Uh, so the images were quite small, but now they are, we've got a sense of them being bigger. So that's good. 
Okay, then we just have the titled. Titled, yeah. And then. Yeah. So that's mid. Um, okay. And that's, so that's a big zoom up, isn't it? But I think that's okay. Um, yeah. Uh, and is that, that's still, um, that hasn't been, <clears throat> no, that hasn't been distorted in any way, Timo, has it? No. No, what do you mean those, the, the Alps were quite pointy like that. Yes, the, I'm just looking at the original. Yes, yeah, so they're quite pointy. Yeah, yeah. No, so it's just... good, and the color is good. There's on the is that filling the four by three frame there? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, perfect. Like they're all filling. Yeah. Like... Thank you. And that one, uh, the blacks. Could you punch the blacks a little bit? Yeah, thank you. Um, really? William, so this is the first time we've seen this four by three frame. That looks lovely, doesn't it? I mean, I, as you know, I'm worried about seeing this on the big screen in food market, but as a frame, that's lovely. It's I think neat. it looks good. Now, like you say, the photo's a bit soft, but it's... Yeah. It's not, it doesn't look wrong or anything. It no. looks nice. No, that's a great frame. And that's a great frame. I mean, we're cutting off the top of our head, but that's appropriate here. Uh, yeah, I'm very happy with that frame as well. Yeah, like I just try to line up the eyes a bit. I mean, they're not Did perfect you? because it's nice. You need to zoom into it, into the older really quite a bit to get rid of the sides. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, well, that's good. That's yeah. really close. That's really a real sense of them looking at each other. And the head's rough, roughly the same size. Very good. I, I like that. Um, okay. So then... Yeah, that's good. And then we're going to look at the positioning of the... So that's very readable. What happened is very readable, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Um, we see, like, later on, I don't know. It depends on, obviously, what the projection is like. Um. But yeah, I mean, that is definitely readable. We need to see about other ones maybe later. But... Yeah, some of them we might need to move on to a darker bit or something. But that's so far, this is, I'm happy. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, there's an argument for moving these left so that they're not on her, you know, jumper. But I think they're very readable, even though the white on white, aren't they? Yeah. Yeah. Maybe once they get unreadable, we just move them. Okay. And then this reminds me so that you did you have to crop that as well? Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. 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 But that's still lovely, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's very nice. <clears throat> yeah. Well, as we mentioned a few days ago, there's a slight movement on this shot, but that's okay, doesn't it? It shows you that it's not a still. Slight. I didn't take it from the very beginning when there's the most movement, so it's fine. Yeah. Shove us a bit, but tiny bit of movement is fine. And then, so this is four by three. Yeah, I made it four by three, though it's four by three already. Is it? Yeah, you sure? <clears throat> yeah, I'll put a four by three sidebar on it. So, like, no, I believe that's it without. Oh, yeah. And that's, that's it. it with. Okay, it's not much difference today. Great, thank you. And just that, yeah. Very nice, yeah. And then same again. And yeah. And Willie, same again. Yeah. And that one. So we're lo and when you crop this four by three, we're losing the edge, aren't we? But that still works, doesn't it, as an image? Yeah. yeah. We're using the, yeah.
Okay, that's nice. Very nice. Yeah, that's a sort of naturally four by three image. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. Uh, now that I, I find that a bit unreadable, Timo. I think you might need to shift that left. Sorry. Okay. Yeah. All right, let me just think. I think that's for on all screens. So let me just five twenty nine thirteen. Why? Um, yep. So you just wait. When you're finished doing that, I'll ask you something. Now, are you worried that that's very close to the edge in case the projector slightly crops it? I mean, it should end, but I can move it a bit if you want. I mean, it works here on this image. Sorry, what were you going to ask? I was going to ask about the size of the typeface on the white film, you know, shot. It looked, the typeface looks bigger. Yeah, I, it, it's just we had, uh, it was just a bit bigger than, you know, in the original. Um, but I can make it smaller, obviously, for 30. If it's not a pain, it, it, it would be nice to keep it all the same size, Timo. Sorry about that. Okay. But if it's if it's a, if it's a lot of work, then we can leave it. It's not a huge thing. <coughs> oh, that's fine. Thank you. So nice to see that these images full frame. Okay. Thank you. Um, yep. Do you have to do that on the other four, other three then, or? No? Oh, really? it's, all, it's, all, it's all done. It's great. Okay. Nice. I love that frame. That's beautiful. Okay, then describe it. That's that's going to be readable on a big screen, isn't it? Okay, describe it. I think. I think so. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay, and the, this is just the framing of all these. So that's that's that fine. Yeah. That's fine. We don't need to see the full name down there. Yeah. Yeah. Lovely. Yeah. 
So like we have me on four screens oh, and all in the middle, I think. Yeah, I think so. It should be good. Yeah, that's readable, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. Wow, look at that. I think that could go left a little bit to you. Okay, yeah. Thanks. We are relying on the projection being, so we'll have to, when we go into fruit market, we have to just look to make sure that there's no cutoff, don't we? Yeah. Where are they? No, it's fine. You can talk. You can ask me something. I was just wondering. So, are you looking for the other moments where you have to make that same change? Yeah. Yeah, I'm wondering. I think maybe it's just one. Yeah, it's just on one. Yeah, it's lovely. Yeah, it's nice black, isn't it? Nice, yeah. Yeah. Oh, should that be capital A, Alps? It should, Timo, sorry. A pin. No. All right, it's just on that one. Good. <laughs> we like when it's only on one. Yeah. Not the eye guy. Yeah. 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 <coughs> That's very readable, isn't it? Yeah. It's so nice that sequence. It's nice. It really works, isn't it? I was yeah. delighted. To, I looked at hundreds and hundreds of stock shots when I saw that. I thought, oh, my goodness. That's so like good. You would think. You would think. You, you, you might have seen, like, I don't know, someone filmed the, the painting or something. It somehow. feels like Film. a tracking shot across a painting. It really yeah. does. It? No. It's crazy. And like, it's also like the angles, you know, like that angle here. Yeah. That one. Yeah. It's really, it shows then, how much she... It's understand, like understood, and perceived ice and depth and cracking and stuff. You know, I think it's yeah, it's a remarkable thing. <coughs> yeah, is that is that la that picture of her? Just to go back to it, um, of Willie. Um, is there any more at the top of that shot? If you you couldn't tilt down a little bit to lose, or are you using the full top of the shot? Do you want to have less headroom? A bit. Uh, if we could lose that bottom band of sort of not very interesting stuff, if you could tilt, yeah, yeah, down a little bit. Is there any more, or is that it? That's, yeah. I mean, I can zoom in more if you want. No, I think it's not going to sustain a zoom in. I had a look at it. It's not particularly strong, but just those few bit, those few bits are good. Yeah. I think that's on two screens, that one. 
Yeah, you're right. No, she's just no. looking at each other, isn't she? Oh, yeah, that's true. Okay, good. Is that okay? Yeah. Nice. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah. Lovely. Oh, there's, a, there's, oh, there's the artifact. Ah, sh shite. Um, so I need to resend you that. I'll make a, should I do that? No, I won't do that now, Timo. Will I do, you, do that this evening and send it to you? Is that okay? Yeah, but I can also just see, I probably. Well, just, just zoom, can you just zoom in on it? Yeah, I can probably do something with it. So. I, yeah, in fact, I thought we discussed, yeah. So I think that if you want to, the right side of the image is very good. So if you can lose the left side and the bottom, oh yeah, oh, there we go. Just go in a little more. And make sure you don't lose any of the right side. So you might want to pan right slightly. The other, the other right, yeah. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah, that's great. Lovely. Eleven seventeen. Let's check. This is Timo going back to the previous edit to make to see if what we're doing on this screen affects what we do on any of the other screens. <coughs> no. Great. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. No, that is, it's a bit blurry, but I don't mind that. As a, I know, I like it. Flash. I think it's, you know, because this is, yeah. That's a bit of a 90s photography. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I like it. I, I took that with my phone, you know, and I think it's, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I like that as well, because it's slightly abstract as well, isn't it? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Love that shot. Love that. See a slight touch of blue. There's a tiny little moment of blue in there for some reason. I really like that. Yeah, that and that little orange. Bit of I really, you know, you don't want to, you know, it would be tempting to correct that, but it's lovely. Yeah. It's a strong thing she says there, isn't it? If you don't want to look at it. Yeah. Yeah. That's so nice seeing this full frame. You know, it's sort of, it was quite painful watching it in four quadrants. Uh, lovely. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> Quite something, you know, this is the confident older woman saying, I'm happy, I'm a better painter than you have seen more. Yeah. Oh, 
observation and construction imagination. Good read Stein. Yep. <clears throat> Slightly worried about this image. I worked on it a lot, but it's a reasonably, yeah, it might look a bit fuzzy, but it doesn't matter because it'll contrast well. The frame yeah. is good. The frame is good. I haven't put the credits in yet. Um, okay. But yeah, you, you saw them yesterday, huh? Yeah, like a huge Scotland will restart. Oh, sorry, Timo. See that the word huge? Could you make that a capital H? Um, we have, yeah, okay, but then we need, like, we haven't done that earlier either, though. Oh, have we not? Okay, well, then let's not do it here. Okay. Okay, so that's screen four. Okay, Onto thank you. That, that clock, that clock looks nice. So you, you remove the hour or the minute, you just put the second, so that looks good. Yeah. Thank you. Cool. Um, that was painless. Huge. Thank you, for, thank you for doing all this work in advance. Yeah, the um, the blacks and that are really strong, so that's good. Yeah, and that's a weird picture, but yes, that's good as well. That's doing what it should do. Yeah. Willy, 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 willy. Willy, 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 willy. willy. That's readable, isn't it? I mean, you could argue that should be on black, but it's on a big screen that's going to be so readable and white. Yeah. Well, no, that's Yeah. I mean, yeah, we're just accepting that this is readable, isn't it? If it's readable on this screen, on the bigger screen, it'll be even more so. Yeah, I mean, and 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 if it's if it's not, I can still change it next week if I have, if we okay. have to. Okay, when we sit in the room and we we're not sure, then okay. Good to know. Yeah. I think that when we look at it on the big screen, we might want to change these to black text. Should, but we, shall we just decide next week? Um, if. Is it easier to do it? It's you know, if we decide next week, it's not a huge amount of work for you. Is it? do you need to re output everything? Well, I need to make change. I need to change every everyone individually. But I mean, if it needs to be done, it needs to be done. Okay. Do you want to do it now, or do you? I'm finding it perfectly readable now, but. So let's not decide now. Let's 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 be happy now with it, and then if next week we need to change it to black text, then that's uh, as, okay. Yeah. Or I mean, it's probably if you're not sure, you could probably also. I I mean I've as you can tell I'm I've got doubts. So, is it is it you know are you able to just I don't know, select all those things and oh, oh you're moving them to the left, yeah. I mean, that's really readable. 
but I think that if we are going to make changes, then it would be better rather than moving them all to the left to make them black. Okay. I'm just not sure because, you know, like that bit here might be hard to read just, in black. Yeah, I think. yeah, yeah, yeah. Can I have a quick look? <clears throat> It's because you don't like drop shadows, Mark. It's a problem. I don't like drop shadows. <laughs> yeah, I know. Okay, if there's anybody watching this and you don't and you're wondering what drop shadows means, it means that you know to make a, a subtitle more readable, it used to be the case that you would put a sort of shadow beneath it. And it did work, it made it more readable, but it also made it for me slightly more ugly. See, like that's how less that's readable, really... isn't it? That's less readable, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. So leave it white. Leave it white, Timo, and we'll judge it next week in Food Market. I'm sure it's fine. And if not, I think we should move it rather than make yes. it blank. I think you're right. Yeah. But it's nice to leave it where possible. Let's leave it in the middle because people understand when there's words on the middle at the bottom of a frame, then it is a subtitle. So, uh, you know, if you're watching this and you haven't heard this conversation before, what we're trying to do is sort of subtitle her thoughts without hear her speak, without hear her speaking. So it's like we're get we're here we're subtitling her in our thoughts, <clears throat> but yeah, but that's I think that's gonna be fine. And that's made four by three. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. yeah. In my lungs. Willie had um, breathing problems in her life, and therefore the the references in this project to her breathing and her lungs are sort of related to that inside my lungs yeah yeah you've already corrected that haven't you yeah yeah it's such a classic image Yeah. And this is an image where you can see the central bits very super focused, but you know it goes out of focus on left or right, so the camera was at to one side. But I think it, we do want people to feel absolute intimacy with the canvas, and I think this image does that. So, I mean, slightly worried when I first saw that, but I think it's worth it just to have this central bit in focus. I think it's nice. Yeah. 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 I mean, there's no particular black in that image, but the original, it hasn't got loads of black in it, I don't think. Yeah. I wonder, sorry, just to go back one, Timo, to the, the previous one, the brown one. Could you just increase the blacks just a, a little bit? I don't want to distort her work, and we're not distorting her work, but it look, it's looking, you know, sometimes when you go close. Yeah. I think that. I mean, I don't know. I mean, Rob and Cassia at the, the, the foundation would tell me, but I think that's slightly truer to what the original is. So let's go with that. Lovely. Lovely. Could, what, could you punch the blacks just a little bit more now? 
excuse me. We do we do want to lose. Did you did you whack up the contrast or just because we don't want to lose any of the white bits? Have we lost any detail on the white there? No. Is it okay? A little bit, yeah. It's the white still there. I mean, it's still there. I can see more. I can see the detail there. Yeah, I think that's good, isn't it? nice isn't it and that's a very faint image so we shouldn't it's, te it's always tempting with an image like that to add more black but i think that's very true to the watercolor my camera's gone out of focus again why does my camera go out of focus come on focus 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 come on got a simple job to do yeah And that looks quite yellow, but the original image is quite yellow as well. So I think that's pretty much right. And if you whacked up the contrast anymore, it would, yeah, yeah, that's good. That's it's, that's true to the picture. Yeah. Yeah, that looks good. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I wonder what those before. Oh, those before, yeah. 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 Here's the color image. Yeah, lovely framing. Ah, so that's quite far up screen, isn't it, Timo? Do you want to put that? Yeah, down? It's just, yeah. I thought because we had it in black, and then it's. Um, I don't mind too much, you know, but if it's it's, it's, it's hard to read down it's yeah, hard to yeah. read. Well, maybe. I could make it white again. Yeah, maybe try try it white. We don't want to make any specific point about the it being up screen in some way. Yeah. That's more readable, isn't it? Yep. And that's how you spell striated, isn't it? Can I just check to make sure? Striated. Yeah. <clears throat> so I do the same here. If you don't mind, yes, thank you. <clears throat>
That's readable when it's that far down over her jumper, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, they're all the same. Actually, they're all the same. Yeah. So that's two of the four screens. Oh, right. This is new. So that's that looks good. I mean, it's tempting to whack the black up there a little bit, but I don't think we should because this is a vintage picture and it should look slightly gray, grayscale. So I think that's good. Okay. Yeah. <coughs> so number two. Then that. Done. There's an A. This one. Yeah, I think if you push the blacks any further there, you'll lose a lot of detail. Would you agree? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. So I think we can't go any further in that direction. Really, 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 really. Oh yeah, we, that's that's the same. Yeah. Thinking, yeah, I think all that is the same than just I know that before. I mean, yeah. Just to explain, if anybody's lost a second here, because we've got um, the same film on four screens with differences, it means that if we made a, a change in one of the previous versions, then Timo's already made the change in this version, so we don't need to redo it. <clears throat> yeah. See, see, just to go back there, Timo, do, am I seeing an exposure change on that picture of old Willie, or is that just the computer? The, the, you know, we fade down and up. Oh, yeah, we do. Okay, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, yeah, these are new, but you and did yeah. we feel high? Yeah. That's not quite where it should be not totally centered yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's the right spelling of hemorrhage, isn't it? Oh, I don't I, I, I don't know how to spell hemorrhage. <laughs> Shall I look? <laughs> yeah, maybe. I've never in my life been able to spell hemorrhage. H A E M. I'm sure I checked this before when I was writing H A E M O R R H A D. Yeah, that's right. You know, actually, would be could I be a pain and ask for that capital A to be made a small A, Timo? Because you know the previous one said dot dot dot, so then it would be better if it wasn't a capital A. Yeah. Sorry. That's okay. <laughs> Thank you. I think that's only on one screen.
Ya. Yeah. That's one where you can see the bottom left is really quite far out of focus, but hopefully it's that one's yeah, that's looking good. Oh, wow, look at that picture. And the blacks are good in there, I think, but you don't want to go super black, I think, because I think that's true. <coughs> yeah, that's one of our masterpieces in there. But... Yeah. Oh, yes, same again. Back again, same again. Sorry, I meant to remove all those things. Um, what did we have it on screen four and we six fifty If you're watching this and wondering what we're doing, there's a little symbol on the bottom left in one of these pictures that we're removing. Nice. <coughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We do have to keep an eye on this because I'm so glad that the subtitles are right at the bottom of the screen, but if the projectors over scan, then we might have trouble, but we can look at that when we get to Great Market. Yeah. 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 Sorry, me being very German. It was the structures I'd long seen, yeah? It, yeah. Yeah. I think so. I know you could. Yeah. 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 <coughs> yeah. 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 Yeah, it's nice. Is that is that an example where we could tilt down a little bit more to see less of the bottom and more of the top or Mm 
No. No. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So we looked at those before. Yeah, those, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And from above it, yeah, we looked at that. Yeah. We looked at that. Yeah, we looked at that. you are. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So yeah, I'm only halfway through this one, so. That's all right. I mean, you've done so much. Thank you. Um, like. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, at the bottom of this picture, there was a. <clears throat> what did it say? Did it say? Um, at the location, I think. Grindelwald. I, I wonder. Yeah. So you can't have that and the mountains. So you had to. You had to zoom in. Is that right? No, I can. <laughs> If you if you want the text, we can probably have that. I mean, I, I, I... Can you zoom out a bit? Or are you are you using the left and right edges of the frame? Um. No, you're using it full frame. So the question is: Are we? Do we want to see? What we haven't what we haven't done is when the audience arrives, Timo, they will there'll be some information on the outside, which will probably name the glacier, but in the installation, we haven't named it. So I don't know. What do you think? Should we have those words at the bottom or should or should we tilt down so we should see the glacier? Um I yeah, I think it's slightly teeny tiny tiny bit irritating to have to read the uh, okay, well then leave it as you leave it as you had it. Nice. That's an amazing image, isn't it? Yeah. Sorry, one sec. Four fourteen. Okay, yeah, no, that's fine. Yeah. 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 Is that the one on the close up that we just, we, push the blacks a little bit? I mean, like they're all, I think similar. I don't think it will be 100% the same, but. Okay, okay. 
fine. Well, let me double check that actually. Um, 546. So that would have been on screen for 546. No, it's a different image there. Yeah, okay. So leave it as it is. I mean, again, we can, if it, look, if it looks a bit washed out in the fruit market, we can make a final adjustment, can't we? Yeah. See, like, so like, that's what we have. So this frame, the frame is all very yeah. similar. Yeah. Sometimes when you go into a closer close up of something, it looks a little bit washed, more washed out because of the lens. But no, I think it, we'll leave it for now and then we can make a final adjustment if necessary. Actually, it will be then this one. Ooh, what's that jump? <clears throat> I, I replaced the foot. No, I did take it from, from the other screen. We made a we did make a tiny adjustment there. Okay. Um and that's how far I got. So great. Okay. Well that's that's great, Timo. Thank you for all that. And it's looking lovely, I think. I mean, um I don't need to I don't to be honest, I don't need to see the rest of it because it or yeah, I mean I just do the same that I've done. And then yeah, okay. I do well unless you want to do it live now. I do I I, mean, I think it's it's no, it's fine. We've got the gist, haven't we? Um so what so um tomorrow look at my stupid camera. I hate this camera. It, I have to put a piece of paper on in front of it to focus it. Um, so tomorrow, it's you're gonna it's gonna be sound work, and you've discussed with Anya. Uh, is your preference to do that live stream or or not? I mean, I don't need to do anything really. No. I don't know how. We just want to talk to Anya about. We want to see my camera. I'm gonna get a new camera, and we want to see if she's got any suggestions. So, well, I think what we can say to anybody listening to now, listening now or watching now, we don't know if we'll be back tomorrow or not. We might be to do some sound work, but we might not. And it depends. Um, there's not a lot of, of sound to do, but we're going to speak to our sound designer, Anya Prishkota, and then if we're back tomorrow, we will send a message. Yeah. So this might be our this might be our last session, Timo. So before we go, we'll finish just in a moment or two. But um, how, how, how have you felt, Timo, about you know editing editing in front of an audience rather than doing it, you know, just you and me? Um, I tried to pretend it was just you and me. Yeah. Um, like I hope it's useful. I did. I did two things. It's also because it's a project we've never done and something a bit unusual and a yeah. bit more complicated. I did feel like, yeah, I wasn't looking forward to it, but it went it went smoother than I thought. And yeah, if if someone, I haven't I haven't read any comments, so hopefully there's not lots of just like look what this idiot is doing, but um. Yeah, hopefully it's it's like what I heard from my editing editor friends was that it's so good to see like you actually being in an editing room with someone because that's yeah. just like how you and me work. We work just like what we've shown and it's exactly I mean we didn't change anything for the audience, did no. we? You know, we sort of no. slightly gossip we gossiped less than we might, but otherwise than that, we the process was exactly the same, wasn't it? It was. So um, yeah, I hope that you don't make this a regular thing that you want to do that all the time. But um, if it if it gave an insight into how I mean, it's also like yeah, it it, it was a bit of a peculiar project. So uh, 
it wasn't like a typical typical edit maybe but if it gave an insight into for people to see like what it's like the relationship between a director and an editor and yeah. Yeah, what yeah, questions yeah. are being asked and um what suggestions come might come out of things and and how the whole process works then it's, yeah it's a good thing i think for people to see and I, yeah and for me the, the fact that this project most of most of the films that we make are funded privately or you know not fully public funded but this because this the, the rather this is a small budget very small budget project but nonetheless it's pu totally public funding and so i thought that in principle it would therefore be good to try and maximize the value of that funding you know by making yeah. it available to anybody, particularly somebody who's not got access to arts institutions or something, you know, who, who knows? I mean, I haven't lifted the figures, maybe hardly anybody's watched, but why not? We've nothing to hide, isn't that right? You know, but the creative process, you know, and, and the more you expose that, the more you demystify it and you sort of want to send out the message like that. This is for anyone in a way, you know, it's yeah. not a kind of, it's not rocket science. Yeah. No, no. It's a, well, it, you know, you know, it's a very technical job which you do, and I just don't understand. But nonetheless, it's it's not nothing to be it's afraid not of. Just for people like it's 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 not an elite experience. Yeah, especially now with technology and like yeah, I mean, if I have some younger people who just started out in the filmmaking and just or like like just start studying and whatever and i'm so impressed what they do and how yeah. quickly they pick up things and uh, what yeah. techniques they can do and like yeah i mean there's there's an editing software on any computer now that you have really yeah yeah, yeah. um and yeah anyone and, can do it really if you want to and we have to keep innovating i feel that me like this camera is annoying me so much get in focus come on we're talking about technology and um, but i i certainly feel that i need to keep innovating at my advanced age and doing new things and coming up with new um ways of of making work you know and so this has been an experiment a new a slightly new way of doing something you know and and being vulnerable etc so you know, if anybody has watched it, you know, we, I should say we have been recording all these. So if you missed it uh, live and you want to really plunge into the Badger cam, then <laughs> you can watch it on playback. And especially if this project, if, like a huge Scotland goes to other countries, then I guess they can, if they want to, if they can be bothered to, they can make this available to people in other countries. Yeah. Cool. Okay, so we'll maybe get back here tomorrow, Timo, and we might not. We're going to do sound work, and we might invite you, the audience, if there's anybody listening or watching, we might invite you back. If So watch this space, watch social media, and we'll, we'll say when we're coming back. Cool. But for 